Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. It's been a very long time. I'm so sorry about my eyebrows. They are odd. I can never do them even. This one goes high, but you know, I'm not even going to get into that. So I've done my base off camera and just on my own. And today I'm going to be doing a makeup look that is going to be inspired by this picture right here. Um, I am going to be using Take Me Back to Brazil palette, which I've never used before. I know it's quite old, but I thought I'd just give it a try. Because I really like the colours in it, because I've always wanted to try something new when I'm doing my makeup. I'm just going to the next stick me. And oh my god, this palette is stunning. Look at all them colours. How nice. So I'm going to be doing this picture, so I'm going to be looking down here a lot at my phone so I can see what I am doing. So this, I think, is going to be a challenge. <laughs> so how am I going to do this? I think I'm going to have to pack the colours on. Do I work out from in or into out? Let's go... I don't go out to in, so I think I'm going to do that. Um, so let's find a packing brush. Okay, got them. This is it's a Murphy brush. I don't know which one, but this is the one I'm gonna be using. It is a tiny bit of mucky. So the first outer colour is purple. I've just realised most of the purple is shimmery. So I'm gonna have to be going in with this one up at the top. And I'm going to pack this in the outer this outer corner of it here and I'm going to go quite high up I am going to be opening a mirror over here by the way guys so I'm going to block my view ok this isn't as dark a purple as what they've got but I haven't got a dark one because it's shimmery so I might have to mix that in I'm not sure and I'm oh god I've got a really bad contour on that. I'm not the best at contour and I am just first starting contour on my nose which I don't normally do so this is a purple I may have had a bit of the darker purple in which is here to deepen it up a little bit but it is shimmery so I don't know how it's gonna work okay it doesn't look like too shimmery so I think I'm just going to do one eye on camera with you guys and then I'm going to try and do the other one and then I'm going to put it all together at the end of the video. Okay, this brow is really irritating me. So the next one is a... Oh, I should have got a makeup wipe. BRB, let me get a makeup wipe. So I am ordering one of them sponges where you can like wipe off the excess of your other colour onto it. But at the moment I haven't, I haven't ordered it because I can't bother. Next is a deeper blue. Ooh, the bow shimmer. Anyway, I think I'm gonna go in with this colour right here for the second colour in after straight after the purple. It's a dark blue, so we're gonna do this one. Probably should I think it's a closer here, you guys. And we can try and do this the other. I'm going to put this right after the Okay, this is not working because this bl brush is wet. So it's not going as well as I want. I think I should do the bigger line. Let me see what's going on. Oh yeah, the lines do get bigger as we go along. But mine so far isn't looking like the picture. This blue's gone too far over. So let's just try and wipe that bit away. Okay, I've just wiped it off. Hello. Blue is better then. That's fine. Well, not again, but we're just going to put some more blue on. Oh, uh, right. Um. Okay, so far, not my best work. This video is so slow, I'm so sorry guys. I'm just, I've never, I haven't filmed in a very long time, as you probably know. 
so it's going to get me white easier. So next is a lighter blue, I'm going to go in with this colour right here. I don't even know if this is going to lead up to the inner corner of my eye. So, side of the brush maybe. Next I'm just going to pack in the blue. This is a very pretty blue. You guys are probably like, oh my god, you're not doing that right, you're not doing that right, just leave it to the professionals. I'm like, I'm trying my hardest, guys, I promise you. I am not the best at makeup at the moment, but I am going to call it, I'm just going to get a bit of deep blue to put that on. Mm, just keep the wiping off. Just tap it. Just tap it, not wipe it. Okay, so this is it so far. I actually kind of like that as it is. Um, so I'm planning on going to college for makeup and try and learn better. Um, anyway, so the next colour is green. It's just like a light green, but um, I think I'm going to go with this middle colour like right here. Looks quite nice green. I'm sorry if there's any parts where you can't see me what I'm doing. I'm trying my hardest to film. Oh god. Mm. It's a mistake. Mm -hmm. Go in the green. And pack that on. I don't need to pack, leave it packed on. Or if I need to, like, you know blend them together but like if you blend them together then it's just not going to look right and this isn't going well so well anyway i was going to do this put this on my instagram but then it's like it's gone look how weird it's gone i don't know if you can tell but it's gone so weird and patchy Ugh. I sometimes makeup can be frustrating and I don't know why it's gone like this. I think it's because I'm using makeup wipes. I think I'm just going to have to go with the blue. Again. Light blue and then the darker blue. I am just saying I'm not the best. So if I, I recommend not using this as a tutorial to do this. I just found the picture on um, the internet. And try and do it yourself and not follow this video although you have seen the picture on this video but if you do try like watching me film do makeup please like and subscribe and turn your notifications on you know can never be too cheeky can you anyway i'm gonna go into a yellow i was gonna use this yellow originally but i think i'm gonna go with this one seeing as a actually no i'm gonna scrap that i'm gonna go with this one it's a little bit more brighter let's see if we can swap my brush Choose this one. Um, a dry green brush. Probably helps if you had a brush per colour. Unlike me, sorry. I don't. Okay, this yellow is very yellow. Like hardly you can see it. Um, and if you have any tips to help me do a rainbow eye better than I've failed so far. Please help me in the comments. Leave some comments. I will be reading to you and replying. So then you can help me learn how to do my makeup better. Even though I thought I was kind of good at doing makeup. This shows that I'm not. Anyway, done the yellow. Not the best. I'm going to go with the orange, which is this colour right here. It's not like a, a, um, a coral and an orange. But we're going to go with it as I really can't be bothered. Okay, right, let's see. You can either see this orange is. Orange isn't pigmented. There's a lot of bar on this palette, by the way. But so far, most of the colours are pigmented. I'm itchy up my nose. And so it's kind of going okay so far. I have very veiny eyes and you can still see the veins coming through. So this is the orange. This isn't clear up, so I think I'm like afterwards I'm gonna cut it with some concealer at the top. 
to make it better. Okay, orange, done. Red, last vinyl step. This red right here. And I'm gonna pop this in the very inner corner. Well, what's left in my eyelid. Okay. I recommend with this palette, if like some of the colors aren't showing up, I'd recommend putting some um, setting spray on your brush. So then you can like make the colors more pigmented, if you know what I mean. So then you can get more vibrant colors and it will look better than what I've done. Okay, that didn't go so well. How does this look so good amount so rubbish? Probably because they're better than makeup right now. Obviously. Um, okay, right, that's gonna be it. I'm gonna go do the other eye off camera. But so far, this is the eye. I'm gonna cut it real quick and I'll be right back. Actually, I'm gonna cut it and do the other eye and then I'll be right back. Okay guys, I've done the other eye and it went a lot better, kind of. So this is the other eye. Red went kind of a little bit too high up, but it went a lot better than this one did. No offense that I did this one. But I'd probably recommend doing your makeup off camera and not trying to film it for the internet to see. As you fail quite miserably, as I found out, as this one went really patchy and stuff around this bit. And this one went a lot better set for this bit here. Anyway, to tie the look together, I thought I'd go with a new lip as I've gone for a very bright eye. So, I've got a Barry M lip liner in Doll, I think, which is a very nude colour. I don't know. There you go. And so I'm going to line my lips and be right back. Okay, I've lined my lips and now I'm going to go in with a Revolution lip lipstick this looks like a mac but it's not and it's in the color chiffre i don't know what that's but you guys can read that very it's very blurry i'm just got my face in it i don't know anyway it's a mac and it's in i like this lipstick so it's going one down really up so i find it's nice with this lipstick with the hair on it and i'm just gonna have my hair Oh, I'm going to get out of here. Okay. And this is this lip. This is this look complete. And I will see you guys in my next video. I don't know when that will be. I don't know if I've got time to record another video yet anytime soon. This is what my arm turns out like after this look. I am like a what's it called you know when you like paint and you have like them palettes an artist palette and other ones. i look like that anyway i will see you all guys in my next video love you bye